We start the volcanic uh, daily report of today with the Popocatabal. Uh, Popocatabal has been erupted for a long time and now it is back to erupt ash. As you can see, the black the, or grayish color uh, uh, material is rising from the top of the volcano. It's important for the aviation. And for this reason, we keep uh, monitoring them. Not far from the Popocatabal in the Guatemala, we have the Santiago or San Miguel volcano erupting. This is a volcanic dome sitting on the top of the volcano, stopping it from erupting. And when it erupts, it will be like this in 1902. It created a bigger eruption, killed some people actually, unfortunately. And hopefully this will not happen like that again. again. A similar setting exists for the Philippines, the uh, Mayan volcano in the Asia to the west side of the Ring of Fire, where a crumbling uh, volcanic dome sitting on the top of the volcano, under the weight of the, its own weight and the gravity, it falls down, crumbles and falls down. But that means just a mass is being added from underneath. So it's erupting in a felsic way with a felsic sticky lava. It doesn't let the volcano erupt. That can be dangerous. It has to let it erupt. Because if it doesn't erupt, it will happen, explode like what we saw in the Shivelich volcano in the Kamchatka of the Russia. Now that we are there, let's just talk about it. Shivelich is erupting at the, at the moment. The volcanic dome, actually, which exploded previously on the, or the past one month and two months, it started to grow actually bigger. And you can see the growth of it by comparing it with the crater left after previous explosion just two months ago. And we can actually show the size of it. The crater is there, the volcanic new dome is there in the middle, and it's growing. They are different to what we see in the Hawaii, where the uh, Halo Mau Mau crater and the Hornito or Spattercorn created there are erupting continuously. They are gentle compared to them because they have a very runny and uh, silica pool uh, lava coming from the earth mantle core boundary. The heat source of it is at least there. And uh, they erupt within the crater of itself. Sometimes they go out, but not in this uh, case. The spatter cone, or the hornito as we call it, is continuing to gently erupt. It has grown in size. And eventually it may actually be either, you know, uh, developed and, uh, you know, get bigger uh, or take over the whole volcano. Or it may just, you know, just block itself up and just uh, seal it off and uh, disappear. Sabanchaya, Sangaya and uh, Cotopaxi volcano are usually erupting in the South America. I will report them separately.